Aaron, uh, I'll just start off by saying it's great to see you. It's been a few years, but it's great it, to see you again, my friend. It has. It's great to see you too. Um, we have a lot to get through in four minutes. I'll just start off by saying I am a huge I Love Lucy fan. Who isn't? And I just want to give you a round of applause, even though it's just you and I right now. Fantastic work. Um, Thanks so much. I The excitement level that I even have just for this interview, because I just love what you've done with this. First question for you, sir, is how long have you been working on this? I think that it was uh, about five years ago that the producer Todd Black asked me if I was interested in writing a movie about the relationship between Lucille Ball and Desi Arnaz. And it took me about 18 months to get to yes. Uh, it's always a big commitment uh, to say yes to writing something. Um, uh, it's, it, it takes a while and you're living and dying with it. Uh, so I've had my head in this for about five years, uh, including the time that uh, I, I started working on this before I started directing Chicago 7. Uh, oh. So it's been a while. Um, there's, I can't, you know, you're the director, you wrote this, uh, The Pressure. Tell me about The Pressure, because who doesn't know of the Arnezes, you know, the, the entire cast of I Love Lucy? It's worldwide. I, I just can't even imagine the pressure that, was there a lot of pressure, did you feel, to get it just right? Well, yeah, but it depends on what just right means. Um, mm -hmm. uh, I, for instance, wasn't, you know, I, I made it clear to Nicole, to Javier, to JK and to Nina that I wasn't looking for an impersonation uh, mm -hmm. of these people, that I wanted them to play the characters uh, that are in the script. And, and I was aware that I was writing and then directing a film about uh, iconic people and people that the public uh, has a very intense relationship uh, with. That said, I kind of always feel the maximum amount of pressure. There isn't really that much room to feel more pressure because it's Lucy and Desi. Okay, what made you pick this particular time period? It's funny because the episode of the Fred and Ethel fight, I, that's one of my favorites actually. Um, and, and I noticed that this period, you know, you went the Monday through Friday from this table reads to where they film. What what made you focus on, on this particular era? This, well, uh, Everything that happens in this movie happened. It just didn't all happen in the same week. I made it happen in the same week uh, to put more pressure on the characters uh, and uh, just bigger obstacles in front of the protagonists, in front of uh, Lucy and Desi. Uh, so, uh, so that's why I, uh, so I created my own time period, really. The reason why I chose that episode, Ethel and Fred Fight, uh, to be the one that they were shooting that week was because, uh, I, I, and I read a lot, maybe all of the I Love Lucy scripts, uh, and I needed an episode where Lucy can pick it apart, where Lucy can have problems with the logic of the writing and ask questions, because uh, I needed to demonstrate that she is a comedic chess master. My friend, great work. I thoroughly enjoyed this conversation. I have so many more questions for you, but you know what? Next uh, time. Next time. My friend, thanks again. Happy holidays. Thank you very much. Talk soon. Thank you, sir.